Hey hey guys, Charmy, and welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I will be showing you the best ways to prepare for the holiday update in Adopt Me. This update will be coming out on Thursday and we will have an advent calendar starting on Friday, December 1st, which is so exciting. We also have some more info on the update, so I will share it with you now. There will be new toys and petware, which all look super adorable. We also now know of some minigames, which include the classic that has been in every single holiday event, which is Penguin Ice Skating. We all probably know about this, but it's a super, super helpful way to get gingerbread every single Adopt Me Day. And now I am so excited because my all-time favorite Adopt Me minigame is back, and that is Pet Rescue. This minigame is so, so much fun because of the team aspect, and I just love it so much. I'm so glad that it's back. There are new pets as well that include the common beluga whale, the rare nutcracker squirrel, and the legendary chocolate chip bat dragon. These are all coming for week one this week. We have another confirmed minigame, which is the Frost Claws Fury minigame, but we don't know what week this is coming out. This does remind me of the 2020 Feed the Frost Fury minigame. I'm going to assume that this might be a pet as well, so that would be super duper exciting. We also know of some sort of portal, but don't really know what its purpose is yet. As you can tell, they've given us a ton of information with much more still to come, but without further ado, let's get into how to prepare for this update. My first tip is to get your inventory ready. This means that you can trade unwanted items, pets, clothing, etc. for decent pets that you can use as trading material. Trading material are things in your inventory whose sole purpose is to be traded for event pets, and in this case, holiday pets. This is so that you first get rid of unwanted items, and two, get amazing items in return for your trading work. Keep in mind that on the first day, trading your material will be super, super hard, so wait about three to four days after the update comes out, when the new pet's value has gone down and you're able to trade them without overpaying for them. Having a lot of this material saved up can help you significantly, especially if you're planning on making any neons or megas of the new pets because gingerbread can sometimes be difficult to save up. My second tip is setting up your ways to grind. A huge part of these events is grinding. It's how you will get 85% of everything in this update. Gingerbread is something that will take time to save up, so it's best to have your methods figure out beforehand. Something I love doing is watching movies and TV shows because, yes, I'm mainly watching something, but I'm also grinding periodically throughout in order to stay productive in-game. Another thing you can do is while being productive in-game, you can be productive in real life. You can clean, organize, do some other things like that, and it makes grinding way less scary. You can also ask your friends to grind with you while calling or FaceTiming to make it more fun as well. You could even make it into a game to see who can collect the most gingerbread. There are so many ways of grinding that are super sufficient for getting that gingerbread. My third tip is saving up Robux. Not all of you guys have Robux and that is totally okay. But with the new holiday season coming up, maybe you can ask for some Robux to use to buy the new Robux pets as well as some gingerbread to buy gingerbread costing pets. Sometimes even 50 Robux can get you some gingerbread. Robux is just a way to buy, but you can also trade. This is another place where having material will really come in handy when you trade unwanted, decent legendaries for the Robux pets because these are more often legendaries, so you do want to have something reasonable to trade. My fourth and final tip is to save up gingerbread throughout the event. Once the event is released, while you're buying new things, keep in mind that this is a five-week event with new items, pets, vehicles, and more being released every single week. So it might be a good idea to save up those gingerbread for these as well so you aren't only buying the one-week items. Well guys, that is going to be the end for this video. I am absolutely so excited for this new update and I'm so excited to be getting back into doing some content for you guys. Christmas updates and holiday updates for Adami are my favorite of the whole entire year so I cannot wait any longer. Well guys, be sure to hit the subscribe button down below, turn on post notifications, give a big thumbs up on today's video, and leave a comment down below answering the question of the day and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!